What's up everyone, this is lolmaster here and welcome back to some more World of Tanks with a really quick update. This was a collaboration me and Cornwell did over a month ago where it was the Fury event. It's an awesome movie by the way. <laughs> and decided to skip a 15 minute intro on our actual recording because it was rather pointless so, so I decided to skip straight to the gameplay. Anyway, enjoy. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know anything about your artillery because I haven't driven uh, that before. Uh, but... where, where, uh, where, uh, where, where are where are you? I am beside you. Well, sh check my turning speed. Check this. <laughs> <laughs> that is crap, <laughs> man. <laughs> like oh. like your travel speed is something like. Uh, one or something. <laughs> yeah. And it is also really slow, check this. Yeah. My artillery isn't that slow. It it it, it, it is nowhere near as uh, fast or anything, but it's but it's it is not really that slow, I can say. And now let's see what we can do. At least this tank I can at least uh, tell one thing about uh, low tier artillery is that they do have uh, short aiming time, so that is one good thing, I guess. But the splash rounders is absolutely terrible. That like, look at that! Did you see that? My shot be right beside him, and he didn't do any damage because, as I mentioned, the splash radius on these artillery are crap. So, in, so in order to do damage, you really want to have, you really want to uh, get the di direct hit. Let's see, can I get that medium, medium two? And no, but also, uh, also my crews are only at, and they got a hit. Nice. But but my crews are only at fifty percent, so yeah. And when you crews can impact a, a lot of things yeah. uh, in this game. And and when you when you have a crews on only like fifty percent, you can expect that much. And there, the M two medium is closing in on us. Be careful. I, I see that. This is not good. Okay. Well, well, so, uh, someone else got him. Yeah. The SU 76. That was good. But hey, hey, a, a Panzer 3A is co oh. coming in. Be careful, be careful, be careful, be careful. I can't turn around fast enough. Me neither. Got them. Oh, I got him. Nice. Nice. The, the, that was the, good. That was close. And. We really need to be careful about now the mortar. The mortar is... Be careful of that about the mortar because the mortar can one shot us. So be careful. Hey, you got him! Nice aim, that. Nice. Yeah. Because, I mean, look at the health, goal. My artillery only have 80 health, and that is pathetic. Speaking of things coming towards us, a Shia. 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 <laughs> And that is nice. Two kills. That went really well. Two kills is not bad. No. So that was a good game. Hopefully we hopefully we get better game this time because you remember in our last World of Tanks collab we got really terrible games. <laughs> yeah, and we we are gonna do like four matches yeah. this time around. It also depends how fast we are going. Yeah. So yeah. Um, and, the, and, really... and, the, and the reason I went for this artillery line is because I want to try out uh, this tank, Bird the Avenger, the F3 304, which is also called, as I said, Bird the Avenger, because it is, it is one of one of the most popular artilleries for some reason. 
So I so I I just want to check that out and see how it performs because well mo most players usually p uh, pick this one. And and yeah. and I, 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 I and I also want to try out this artillery, the Crusader SP, because this artillery is actually quite hilarious. Uh, in what way? Because the reason this this artillery is hilarious is that it is the only tank in the game that has faster reverse speed than the forward speed. Uh, okay, uh, are we talking big trucks of the road driving? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> like, 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 this tank, this tank, as you can see there, this tank can only do 14 top speed for some reason, and that is really, really slow. But I have seen this tank go over 40 kph in reverse. So you, you you mean it's it's like the big trucks? Can it can it go so fast that the screen disappears? Well, not not that fast, but this much faster than driving forward. So that is one hilarious thing. So yeah. And yeah, uh, for for those uh, of you that doesn't know what I am talking about, big trucks off the road driving is one of the worst games ever made. Well. That game is actually called uh, Big Rigs Over the Road Racing. Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> but, so well, uh, let's make uh, let's go a huge step up now. We did tier fear free. Now we are gonna go to tier five. Tier five. And the ELC AMX. And uh, as you can see here, I have upgraded all of my ELC now, so I have the best gun, the best tracks, well, best in everything. Yeah, um, well, yeah, let's do an ELC pattern, why not? Let's hope we get a decent march making, and... Indeed, we do. And yeah, we did. And the, the best. And, and uh, uh, as you can see in our team, we have the new tank, which you, you, you can purchase, which is called Fury. And Fury is basically the tank in the new movie. And I think I think it is based on a a, a Sherman tank or something. I think. Yeah, it was. And. Too bad we, we start on this side because on this map I generally want to start off in the in the opposite side but oh well. I'm going to uh, go this go. this way. I am following you. Yeah you do that. Uh, yeah, this tank is actually a good tank, but it is hard to play, so if you don't know what you're doing, then you're gonna fail. Yeah. And uh, because, like all light tanks, they are really squishy, so they, they die really, really fast and easy. Yeah. And I'm going to go up here. Let's hope we don't get spotted by anyone now. Um. Uh, so far, nothing has showed up, but I don't want to stand beside you because we really need to be well, careful because there might be attacks that that will approach over here. So if we don't get support around here, we have to get moving. So we need to be careful. Yeah, I, I think I'm gonna stand here. I don't know if that is wise, but and uh, as a uh, look at that, we have two light tanks uh, behind us. Yeah, that's not good. And I got, I just got shot. Who shot you? Oh, that tank. The VK. I'm, I'm going to see if I can, if I can get a shot on, on him. He hasn't spotted me yet. And the shot went low. So yeah, the accuracy on this gun is not that great, but.
I will see chance. if I can get that past the 38 NA, but he, no, he takes cover. Too, too bad uh, depression right there. Yeah. And this match is going terribly. You see, the, the enemy are leading 2 to 0. Wow. Which means that it's not below. We it... have a shit team. Yeah, maybe. Um, hey, you should talk over there. See, I'll see if I can get a shot, shot on him. A tag. And goddamn accuracy. Well, I can get a shot on him. Can I do it? No! I don't think I got spotted. I'm, go Someone I'm going to help that uh, T4485 if I, if I can, but I still need to be careful. M6. Can I get him? I don't know if I am willing to... No. Come and help me, I, I, I need help. Sure. Damn it. That is dangerous, be careful. No! Uh... Uh, bye bye. Okay, le let's see if he can. No! Oh, god oh! Damn! I thought. Ah, oh, god damn! At first, yeah, I thought I uh, killed you there, but I didn't. That it was him that killed you. Yeah. Can, can can you take him? He only has 12 life left. Well, I, I need to be careful. I don't want him to make any stupid mistakes. I'm going to wait for him to come at me. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> What? The artillery helped me at least. That was good. Yeah. Well, you're going directly uh, to the base, it seems. I'm actually, can... I am actually really surprised because... Um... I, uh, even though he used high explosives, me, he didn't penetrate me for some reason. I kinda confused about that. That is weird. What? Whoa, uh, good job. I got him there. But, uh, but well, I think you need to be more careful now. You got yeah. many tanks on you. I'm, I'm going to see if I can. Well, never mind. I was going to see if I could take on that uh, M6, but we didn't have to because our M4 took care of him. Yeah, uh, watch out for Panzer. Panzer ID. Yeah. Well, the guy that killed you before, he had a derp gun, so he basically one-shot at you, but, but as I said uh, before, he didn't seem to, to one-shot me for some reason. I don't... I'm kind of confused about that because this tank doesn't have any armor. No, I'm kind of surprised that too. The, Watch out! The tog, I need to get out of here. Yeah, you do. Because he will one shot me. Because I don't have any health left. Watch out! Oh, this is. You survive. I think I, I think I need to take them on on a distance in order for me to be able to do anything because I can't go in close range. No. Oh. 
Actually, I I'm going to uh, go back to my base. Oh, w watch out! There, there are two enemy tanks. Yeah, I know. That, that are camping our base. I'm going to go back to the base and see if I can. Damn it! I I'm looking uh, through you right now through a first-person perspective. Alright. I don't know what to do. This is bad. Well, I have been spotted. God damn it. Get out of there. Good job. That that went that went good, but but I but but, but I played really carefully just because if I had rushed forward, I would have been dead there. But yeah, yeah, I know. I'm actually going to use this bush as a cover in order because well, as uh, but, uh, uh, as you can see, that I have only seven health left, so. Anything will kill me if I do something wrong, so... Yeah, uh, what kind of tanks do the enemy have left? Um... We have they have a TOG and a VK361H left, but... So... That is basically... Two heavy tanks, then? Yeah. Like, the only way I can uh, take them on on myself is if I can use my camouflage and view range to, to advantage so they don't spot me. Yeah. Because, because... Like, even a tickle from the ram will, will kill me. That's, that's how low health I have. <laughs> yeah, they, uh, they, I see that. They don't even have... They don't even need to... Ram me to kill me. They, they only need to touch me, and and then I'm dead. <laughs> because this this tank is really dangerous to be rammed from. Yeah, you 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 don't wanna get rammed in an ELC. No, you don't. I'm I'm actually going to go the other way. I don't know where those two last tanks are, and that is really worrying. Yeah. What I am thinking you should do is maybe like patrol a little around the base. Oh no, uh, t t try to scout in, in some good bush and try to spot them for uh, for your partner. Don't drown yourself. No, I won't. I wonder where we are. Actually, I have no idea where we are. So I don't. So I. They are somewhere. Somewhere, yeah. This Tog. Watch out. He he hasn't spotted me, so I can see if I can get good shot on him. Damn it! Why do I have to miss? And of course, there's a rock right behind you. It, why, wait for your. Point, why do man. I miss when I really don't need to miss? I can't afford any misses. No, you, you're spotting for for your partner and see if he hasn't spotted me. So come on, don't miss, please don't miss. Good. Back off, backing off, backing off. Well, he hasn't spotted me. 
What I'm doing right now is I, I, I try to use my camouflage and view range so he doesn't spot me. But... And there... Okay, they, they both are there. As you can see, there. Both of them are, are there. Well, I got one shot on the top at least. Yeah, you did. And here uh, your partner comes. Spot for him. Whoa, whoa. I'm afraid that if I if I'm going forward, they will spot me. That is what I'm concerned about. But, uh, what uh, does uh, the player mean by that? There was someone in, in our team that said, "Go, I see." Whoa, whoa! Look. Yeah. Good, you, you, you spot the one. Let, let's hope your partner can take it down. He's there. He's up there. You can try to shoot him, but... And of course I bounce. Why do I have to bounce? Why? This is really bad. Yeah, but Come at on. the same time, kind of exciting. Like, both of us ha have a... Uh, well... It, good, uh, good, 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 good. I, I think we can win this. And indeed we did. <laughs> and the, that, that's what I mean by it, it was exciting, like... Sure, when you're dead, you, uh, you say it is going badly, but... When there are, um, um, like, same number of tanks on on both teams, you're like, oh my god, who is gonna win? Yeah, that that it, that, 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 like, that, uh, that was really really good. That, that was a really good match actually. I was kind of afraid uh, though because, as you can see there, I I had no health left. So I, so I was kind of afraid, of, but fortunately we did uh, we did it. That went really good, actually. I thought we, we were going to lose there, but I managed to carry the game. <laughs> me and yeah. me and that M4. Yeah, and that that was good. Yeah. Good game. And now, um... and now I'm gonna let you choose the the last two matches. All right. Um. We can do uh, tier A platoon. I uh, 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 what I would suggest is that we we save tier A for the last match because. Okay then. Um, what tank did you have? Um, I have EOC, Renault, FTL, SP, Motor, Motor Free. You know. Grilla, you know what? Covenanted Tog. You know what? T60, T46, social free. You know what? We we can do a tier t tier free match because I want to show off this little tank, the Renault UV57, the smallest tank in the game. Yeah, sure. So choose your mother. Because yeah, th this is the smallest tank in the game. Because look at that thing. It is even smaller than the ELC. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it is, however, fairly good. Because being that small does have its advantage because you are hard to hit and you have a really good camo value and you also have a good gun. But the and but the smart of course, making. Of course we have to get bad march making. And a bad map. Ugh. Yeah. I don't. I, I, I don't like this map. Why? Why? Because 
it is awkward to play with. I mean, it, it, uh, I can at least say that it is a good map for like a heavy tank and such, but playing as a playing as a low tier tank destroyer, nah, I don't think so. Uh, and here you can see at my screen, I, I am looking at Lone Maester. You can see how small that tank is. Let, let's compare y y y you and um, uh, my tank. L look at his tank. Yeah, you can see. <laughs> it is re really small. The mortar is like twice as big as this tank. But... Like, yeah, small, ta you, you small, do have small tanks count. does have really good camp block. So that is really good. And that is actually a good thing for a tank destroyer because a tank destroyer is focused on sniping from far away. Yeah, and but and one big disadvantage or two uh, big disadvantage because while this tank doesn't have any armor whatsoever, and the other problem is that it has terrible gun depression. And if you don't know what gun depression means, gun depression means that how much you can turn the gun down at the ground. That is what gun depression means. Yeah. So this tank does have really bad gun depression. And the gun elevation is not terrible, but not good either. And the gun, gun elevation is, of course, the opposite of gun depression. Yeah. Um, whoa, 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 I need to back off. My... Uh, uh, my gun acceleration is... Yeah. It's not good, but it's not bad. Depression is, well, well pretty bad. Uh, can, uh, can I look at your tank? How much gun depression do you have? Well, uh, uh, it, uh, well it's a, it, it, it is, is alright. Mine is much worse. But if you want a tank, uh, look at artillery, for example. Artillery has really, really good gun elevation, but terrible gun depression. Well... You, well, you need to back we, we, off, you need to back off. Yeah. We, we will die if we send it. Back off, back off. I am gonna do that. God damn. We are still not gonna survive this. Huh. Well, I don't, not I don't know what we are supposed to do because... I mean, a tier 5 game in this map... Like... I'm going to see if I can get this. We, we got entry. the entry leave. May, may, maybe we can take it. No. I'm in. Well, I think we are gonna win this match at least, but. but I mean, a tier 5 game in a tier 3 tank destroyer on this map, like. No, sh no, no, way. no chance. Like this, like this, this is pointless. Like, I mean, we, we are going to win this, but... We're dead for it. Everyone yeah. Get out. Yeah, and, well, we, uh, here we... Uh, here we can look at our teammates and talk about their tanks. For one change, he, here we have a uh, Matilda. I don't know... ...very much about this tank, but... Uh, ...how much do you know, Lollmeister, about Matilda? Well, Matilda is a British medium tank at least, and it, even though it, it is a medium tank, it plays more like a heavy. It has good rate of fire, and it has really good armor for a tier 4 tank. Like, it, like, it has, like, the same armor, like the AMX-40, but the gun is better on Matilda than AMX-40. So, so Matilda is kind of like an AMX-40, but with a better gun. Yeah, and Matilda got destroyed. Yeah. And and, and that time the F we the, the, we got the KV one, but you 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 can mention your first. The SVM for the for the six pack four. That is a tier three, uh, French tank destroyer, which is actually a premium tank, and it it is actually quite a good premium tank because the gun is really good on that tank. 
as far as I know, but I think it is one of the slower tank destroyers at least, but the gun is really good and, and, and it is a premium tank as I mentioned. And the KV-1, you probably all know what, what it is. Because, well, yeah. KV-1 is one of the more popular uh, tanks. And, yeah, the KV-1 is a tier 5 Russian heavy tank. That, that has a good gun and good armor, but is kinda slow. Well, now it's starting to get interesting. Yeah, we are winning twelve ten, so we 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 might win this, but yeah, we we're definitely going going to win this. Uh, one thing though is I and teeth. and this tank the KV uh, two hundred twenty that tank that has five kills. I think it is a premium tank that that is no longer available. Uh, or something like you, uh, I don't think you, you, you can get this tank in a normal gift shop when you they are buy where you buy premium tanks. But I think the KV two hundred twenty is like it is pretty much a KV one with bad armor but worse gun or something. Uh, one thing I, I am wondering is what is the difference between T if. Uh, for the four uh, in tier uh, in tier five and T thirty four in tier eight. Well, that is a good question. Uh, they uh, they uh, they have almost the same name, or they have basically the same name, except this T thirty four, the tier five one, have like a minus si symbol between the TF-34 and, and like they have basically the same name but they are two completely different tanks yeah uh, in, in what way? well the tier 8 T-34 is a rush it's a American tier 8 premium heavy tank and the T-34 is a Russian medium tank which I actually have and it is that tank that la that leads to the medium tank line, for example the frying pan of doom and also tanks like the T-54 and such. Whoa, I I am actually surprised here. L -l -l look uh, Master Badge first class, fire for effect, and two spot things, and I did damage to two tanks. Did you seriously get a uh, third class master batch? Yes. Well, that was surprising because that is usually hard to get. So that was uh, that, that was surprising because though to get first class master batch you, you need to do really well. I did actually get first class master batch on the ELC game. Yeah, uh, and I got it here. Uh, and fire for effect cause more damage to enemy vehicles than the hit points of your vehicle. Then two spottings and two damage to vehicles, and experience I got really good one thousand one sixty four. Well, I I, I only got uh, eight hundred nineteen, but that was three double I think. Yeah, and so yeah, that game while we won, we didn't do all that well because well, I mean a tier five game in, in these tanks. Yeah. Like, if, like, if, uh, if you play your tier 3 tank story in a tier 5 match, match the, only cha the only purpose you have is to snipe, and this is one of the worst maps to snipe on. <laughs> so, yeah. yeah. Okay, shall we end it off with the big boys? Yeah. So yeah, let's go tier eight. Mm. I don't know what which I'm going to choose. I mean, I want to show off the frying pan and maybe the give it a GW Tiger. But the thing is, these tanks gets normal mark making, while the Jag Tiger and my IS6 gets premium mark making. So 
I will, pro have... I will probably sh show off these two new tasks in, in, a, in another video, but for now, I'm actually going to show Dia 6, so we both get the same matchmaking, and we both of, both of us are tier 8 premium tanks, so yeah. yeah Let's go. Uh, and uh, yeah, uh, have you shown off the Dia 6 before? Well, I have sh shown off that tank once in one of my videos, but that match went kind of not that great. And as you can see there, yeah, we got the tier 9 game, but fortunately tier 9 is the maximum match making you get on this tank because because the IS-6 and the Yai Tiger 8.8 does, doesn't get into uh, tier 10 games like some other tier 8s do because well, we get premium match making. Yeah. And, and the reason they get premium match making is that the guns are not good enough to uh, to perform in a tier 10 game. Like, if you look at the, the IS-6, like, 175 penetration, that is barely, uh, barely acceptable in a tier 9 game, and it wouldn't stand chance against tier 10 tanks. So that is why the IS-6 uh, gets premium matchmaking. Yeah. And the Jag Tiger, while it while it while it it has better penetration than me because your penetration is like 200, but 200 penetration is still not that good enough for tier tier 10 game. So that is why you also get no, premium matchmaking. And speaking of the Jai Tiger, I think I have mentioned it before, but that gun that Jai Tiger gets is the same gun you get on the Tiger 1, but the Jai Tiger has much better rate of fire. Yeah. So that is, so, so that, that is one interesting thing. But what the hell am I doing? What do you mean? Try to find the bush because this map does have a fair good amount of bushes. Yeah, uh, I'm thinking of doing that because but, I played but, wrong but, before. But since I, I am a heavy tank, I'm going to go more forward. But, yeah. but I still want to be careful because, well, we are facing tier 9 tanks, like the E75. So I really want to be careful about that tank because I can barely penetrate the E75 at the front with, with the IS-6. So yeah. <laughs> We, we got another IS-6 on the enemy team. Yeah, we do. And of course, some some teammate has has to be in the way. Well, it was over the hill. I don't know if I can get any good. I think I'm gonna move to the other bush over here. Hope I don't get spotted. This is actually tense. Do, do you agree with that? A, a little bit. I am kind of scared about that easy to fight because IS six doesn't have a much chance against the E seventy five. I'm going. To, I'm, go, I'm going to see if I can get. Never mind. I want to get that IS six, but one of my stupid teammates got him instead. Can I get over here and try to? Shoot at that C seventy five, or I'm going to shoot at that C seventy one, and I got a good damage on there. Yeah, and I can shoot anything from there. All is over the hill. Well, you need to uh, go to a better position then if you can shoot at anything. Yeah, I, I know, but I I'm but, kind but, of but, scared. But you you don't have to be careful because we we are cleaning house at this side. But unfortunately, the enemies, as you can see, you can see there, they are approaching the left side, most of them. I, I think I'm gonna go into the bush here and try to wait for them. I'm not sure if I, if I, if we are going to attempt to tap, or maybe try to uh, go to the other side and take on. I need to be careful there, I don't wanna go too much.
And I really like the camouflage skin I have with my IL-6. I like this color on, on it. Yeah. Well, I need to be careful. There I see a uh, uh, SVM-50. Yeah, I see him too. I, I see him on the map, but I don't see him on... Damn it. I, I am kind of nervous here. Actually, that... Well, it is going fairly good, actually, so... I think we, we will have this. Yeah, but I am kind of nervous that... That that the tank is gonna come up behind me or something. Well, you are the most far behind, so you don't have to be that worried. I, I I'm worrying where they going forward. That's it, be, because I, I don't want to be where, where you are. I I don't want to be in the line of fire, as to say. Goddamn low damage roll. Only 320 damage. Uh, Where did that come dam from? I see the FCM. Can, can anyone spot him? I'm going to see if I can get this FCM. And that one bounced. That one bounced. I'm kinda surrounded. I hate that. Panther 3, can I get the. Stupid Panther. Where are you, Panther? I don't like Why this. does he have to fucking use gold ammo? Okay, I, I must risk it, otherwise I won't get any damage this round. Well, I, 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 I haven't done much damage either. I, I have only done two damage. Or, I mean, not two damage, but two hits. So I haven't done that well this match. I'm, I'm, I'm going to see if I can get the Panther 2 at least. Yeah, I want to get him as well, but I don't think I get him. I'm gonna get him. Nope. I didn't do anything that match. Well, at least we won. Yeah, we did. <laughs> I was being really, really careful there. Yeah. Almost too careful. Yeah. Like, um, like you're right. But when you're playing a tank destroyer, you have to be careful. But you played a little bit too careful that match because you, you didn't well shoot shoot shoot, shoot, shoot anything, didn't you? Yeah, I I tried to, but yeah. they they were they wasn't in line of sight or. Yeah, but I think you played a little bit too careful that match. But otherwise, otherwise it uh, it went good. Yeah. So, so yeah, that was good at least. We, we didn't have any terrible games at least, uh, except one that that was that you know, the, the tier three tank story match. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, but uh, but we didn't get any defeats. Uh, we we died, but we didn't get any any defeats. No, you're right. We didn't get. We didn't get any defeats actually. That was quite surprising actually. No defeats at all. Unlike the so, unlike the last match, or not the last match, the last call up we did. Yeah, the, the, that was defeat of the defeat of the defeat. Yeah. <laughs> well. So yeah. It was fun to it was fun to do this again because. It it, it was some some time ago. Yeah. We we did a collapse. Yeah, and it and it is really uh, uh, fun to do a collapse of this game actually because, yeah. Ma yeah. May maybe sometime I, uh, uh, my dad can uh, be on this as well, uh, at least playing with us because, as I mentioned before, my dad also played this game a lot. <laughs> and I just added. Uh, one uh, of my cousins, shall we say, or something like that, on Skype. And as speaking of my dad, he's online right now, but yeah, we are, and, we are going to cut uh, this here. Yeah, and it seems like the person I added on Skype also plays this game. Really? 
Yes. Nice. So yeah. And yeah, uh, and yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, as you can see, uh, uh, see it, my friend. Please, I have actually uh, added a uh, quickie baby and um, the mighty Yingas on my friend list because, well, why not? They are they are they are the best yeah. World of Tanks YouTuber. So. Yeah, I, I also did that, and but but I, uh, yeah. Then I also it would, young it, it, it would be really really fun if they could join us on the collab someday, but the chances of that are, you know, really low. Minimal. <laughs> really yeah. low, yeah. <laughs> but anyway. So yeah, and, and yeah, spe yeah, speaking. Well, speaking of. YouTubers that have been really low. Look at this. Uh, I'm looking right now at Yummy Mash, and he has only did one battle. Yeah, that is that I quite wonder because he did the World of Tanks video uh, uh, sometime like the last year or something, I think. And as you can see here, that was the only match he did. So after that World of Tanks video, he didn't do anything else with this game. <laughs> Uh, uh, as you can see here. No, so, yeah. uh, one last thing. I'm gonna show off Quickie Baby's profile. And for those who are wondering, uh, is he really that pro? Yeah, look at this. Uh, 26 yeah, you, million yeah, 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 battles yeah, 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 yeah. and 61 victories. Yeah. That is. You, you, yeah, you can see that. But Quickie Baby is one of the best, if not the best, uh, World of Tanks player. <laughs> yeah, he, he is. L I mean, l look at his Top Gun 705 times. Yeah, and Top Gun means that you get 6 or more kills in a game. Like, if you can see it, my record, I have, I, I have only gotten Top Gun 14 times. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, um... But yeah. But anyway, uh, we're going to cut this uh, this video here. We we will of course do more in the future. Yeah, we will. So yeah, this has been Cornville, uh, aka Cornville six hundred sixty six. And if you like this video, grab the hell of the like button. See you all next time. Bye guys. And yeah, this has been Long Master, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video collab and well yeah see you guys all next time